Hi, everyone, welcome to Ace Movie Channel. I'm gonna walk you through step by step creating a new project in Ace Movie. In this tutorial, I'll teach you how to create a new project and change your project settings. As soon as you open Ace Movie, you're gonna see this window here. On the right side, you can open up recent projects and quickly get to work. On the left, you can open a project you already have or start a new one. So if we click New Project, we're inside Ace Movie looking at our new project. Ace Movie is not going to name your project until you import some media into it. After we have media in our project, we can go to the top left corner, where it says File, and click Save Project As, and go ahead and name the project, and save it where you want to keep it. After that, we can go up to File again, and go to our project settings. Here, we can change the resolution with this drop-down menu, and we can choose whatever resolution we want for our project. 1920 by 1080 is a standard resolution for YouTube, television, and even movies. Most cameras these days record in this resolution. Even your smartphone most likely defaults to capturing video in 1920 by 1080. So this is usually a good choice. If you have a camera that shoots 4K, then you can select that as well. This will be a much bigger file for your computer to handle, and most people don't have a 4K display to view the video on. If you want to put the video online however, or want to give your computer an easier time exporting, you can use 1280 by 720. This resolution still looks pretty good, and will save your time while exporting and unloading. Under that, we choose the frame rate of our video. Most smartphones record a 30 frames per second. However, the standard for filmmaking is usually set to 23.98. The frame rate you want might take a little bit of research. But it's important to find out what frame rate you shot your footage in. Don't worry about it if you don't know what the settings of your video should be. When you first drop a clip into your timeline, Ace Movie will ask you if you want to keep the project settings, or to match with the clip you dragged in. And I'll show you that now. As you can see, by dragging the clip down to the timeline, it opened this window here. I can choose to keep project setting, or match to media, or click this check here if I don't want the program to ask anymore. One thing you want to do every time before you leave the program, is make sure you save your project again. You can do that by using Ctrl S on Windows, or Command S on Mac to quickly save the project. Alternatively you can go up to the file menu at the top left to save you project. Thanks for watching. Check out our other tutorial to learn how to edit video with Ace Movie. If you have any suggestions, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, and subscribe for the new videos on the channel. See you next time.